Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Janae Mickles, and this is going to be my updated skincare routine. I'm wearing the same thing I just had on in my um, dandruff video because it is the same day. I just thought I should do an updated one. I did one, um, I think it was the summertime, I'm not sure. It's kind of the same, but a couple things have changed. So, the cleanser is still the same, I'm pretty sure. I still used this in my last video. It's the Clinique Liquid Facial Soap for oily skin. I've been using this since I was in ninth grade. So, should I put my hair up? I'm gonna put my hair up really quick. Let me go find a hair tie. All right, so this has hair in it, don't judge me. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna just put my hair back. Oh, and guess what? My clip-ins came in today, so I'm gonna record that video tomorrow. I already tried them on and everything, and I like them. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to put this on my hand, wet my hands a little bit, and just like rub it into my face. Um, I like to do it with like more hot water than cold water. And I always rub going up, because I learned in hair school, never rub going down, always rub going up, because you wanna keep your face up and tight, you know? So, rub it up. And if it's not like really spreading, just add a little bit more water to it. Even up here, go up, not like, never go down. All right, so I did that, and now I just wet my washcloth, and I wet it with really, really, really hot water. Fold it like that, and I just like switch sides, so I'll go like this, and I just wipe like that. And then I'll do the same thing over here. Okay. All right. So I went to Bath and Body. Not ba yeah, Bath and Body Works like last week, and the woman was like, "I should get this because it was only five dollars." So yeah, it says directions: apply mask to dry, clean face for ten to fifteen minutes. Remove mask and massage excess product into skin. So this is the shea butter and jojoba oil one. Um, it says it's rich and nourishing. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. I just ordered some food, so hopefully they don't um, come while it's like on my face. I'm struggling y'all. I can't see. I got my glasses on my contacts in. I'm like, oh it's so cold. Alright, so it's on, it's so cold, but um, I'm going to leave this on for about, um, my lips too big. I'm going to leave this on for about 10 to 15 minutes, and then I'll come back so you guys can see my skin. Ugh. Okay, so it's been about 12 minutes, so I'm going to take this off. And I'm just going to rub the rest into my face. Mm, so lot. Okay. Um, the next thing I'm gonna use is the same thing I use in my other video, which is my favorite, which keeps my skin looking even at all times. It's the um even better by Clinique. This is like the best stuff ever. It's changed my skin so much. Like I don't know. Like my I don't know. I feel like this is like what makes my skin look good without makeup. And I use about um, two pumps in my hand. Mm. 
Okay. Now, I used to use the Clinique, I think it's the Dramatically Different Moisturizer in like the yellow um, jar, but now I've been using this. I got it in a um, pack from Sephora with my points. It's the Ultra Repair Cream by First Aid Beauty. So it's this, and basically it says it's an intense, it says it's intense hydration for a dry parched skin. And you guys know in the winter time your skin gets really, really dry. I've been loving this stuff. Like it's I might have to like buy the full size thing. It smells like it doesn't smell good, but it doesn't smell bad either. But So basically, that is everything that I do to my skin nowadays. It might change. Um, once a week, I do use the apricot scrub. I'll show you guys that. Once a week, I do use the, um, I say apricot. So yeah, once a week, I do use the oatmeal and honey scrub from Queen Helene, which you can get anywhere. Um, basically, it just, um, basically, it just exfoliates your skin. So I do this once a week, or I try to do it once a week. Um, I've been pretty good about it lately, so... Yeah, this is my skin. I'll get close so you guys can see. This is my skin. I don't really have um, acne or anything. I never like really dealt with acne. I used to have bumps like right here like, in my forehead, but that was like high school. So for the most part, my skin is pretty clear. I do have very, very oily skin. Like, <sighs> by let's say like um, I wear no makeup, but like three o'clock my face is oily. So I have oily skin. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm messing with my skin. I like it. Um, it's been very clear the past, what, year, year and a half. So yeah, I like the products I've been using. This is like a staple. Like I would never stop using this facial cleanser. And I would never stop using this. I did think that this would um, fade out my freckles because I know some people say that, um, what is it called? Not I don't know if it's not fade cream, I don't know, but I guess things that make your skin even does fade out your freckles, but I haven't had a problem with that. My freckles are still here, I don't know if you guys can see, but they're not that apparent, whatever. But yeah, so this is my skincare routine for 2018. If it changes, I'll do an updated video. But yeah, so I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching.